So I don't think I have an official intro for this vlog. So hello. Um, this is hours later that I'm recording this intro, but I just wanted to say hi and welcome to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Tahita. I am a compliance analyst as well as a content creator here on YouTube as well as on Instagram. Um, but yeah, I think by the time you're viewing this, it would have been a few days into the new year. So happy new year. I hope 2023 brings nothing but blessings, prosperity, health, peace, and joy to each of you watching this video. So yeah, like I said, just wanted to do a quick intro because I think, I don't think I recorded an intro earlier. So how y'all doing? I hope that you guys are doing great and are ready for all the blessings that 2023 has in store. But let's get into today's video. Hey guys, so. I am currently um, headed to pick up my Nothing Bunt cake and then I will be heading, sorry y'all, y'all know I don't, well I don't have a stand now but typically when I do have my stand it's temperamental so why is my um, exposure going in and out? Girl, get it together. Anyways, as I was saying, I'm about to go pick up my cake. That reminds me, I have to call Nespresso. I have to call Nespresso because I want to see if they have the lime Berturo pods in stock before I actually go in. But yeah, so we are headed to the mall area so I can get this cake. If they have my pods, then I'll go in and get my pods. And then if they don't, I'll um, head to the other side of town where the Trader Joe's is because I'm probably gonna pick up one of those uh, bottles of wine, the sparkling wine that I was telling you guys about yesterday. And I'm gonna stop at Benny so I could get Actually, no, I'm not going to go to Trader Joe's. Scratch that. I'm going to go to Benny's. I'm going to get either a Vouv or Pierre Peters if they have it. Um, Pierre Peters is so hard to find. Hold on. But, so Pierre Peters is another one of my favorite brands of champagne. Um, I think it's champagne. If Yeah, I think it's champagne. But... They're another one of my favorite brands. If they don't have what I'm looking for, which is the Blanc de Blanc, um, then I'm probably going to get Vouv and then some cigars for the hubby. And I also have to figure out what the hell we're eating later on. I have no idea. I have a lot going on and I didn't plan this out too tough, but I did most of what I needed to do yesterday, so I don't expect today to be a lot. It's just that I didn't, we just have too much going on. <laughs> we have too much going on. Stop at the mall is over with. Now I am headed to get some food. And then it's back on the other side. Of the, well, I'm gonna drop the food off. Um, and then it's back to the other side of town so that I can um so I can get what I need for my soup for tomorrow. Shit, while well, I'm thinking of it, I'm like, I need to think of things to eat later <sighs> so I'm thinking asparagus maybe some scallops I don't 
don't know. I'm really, really trying to think. Let me call Mariano's to see if the grill, if they're grilling today, because that would be ideal. sucks i need to get i don't know we're just gonna work with it um i have been cleaning for the most of the afternoon since i got back in so um i literally cleaned the kitchen cleaned the dining room our living room area both sections were pretty clean those are kind of the most untouched sections um in the house you'd think you know the living room is where we watch tv but recently it's just been us in the room. So, uh, and of course the kitchen and then the dining area is just somewhere we kind of put the mail. <laughs> so, um, but it's also where I feed Lola. Lola has a little corner in our dining room. So um, yeah, I did that, cleaned out our, our bathroom, changed the linen out, vacuumed. Um, so I did quite a lot in the past few hours. And then I actually sat down and tried to do my nails. I'm not even, we're not even gonna do a close up because they suck, <laughs> they suck. I don't know if it's because I was in the living room doing them, I don't know, but they just suck. And also, I wanted to say that 
when I got back home before I started cleaning, the hubby told me that basically our internet is out and it's an outside issue. So it's not something that I can like reset the modem or reset the box. It's just out until a technician comes to fix the line outside. So we are living off of hotspots right now, um, which sucks because, you know, modern day TVs were powering our entertainment through like Amazon using their fire sticks or, you know, Roku's or any of those like digital cable systems, I guess. I don't know what they're officially called, but y'all get what I'm trying to say. Um, we watch TV through apps now and apps are powered through the internet. So yeah. Uh, so yeah, I've been using my data to watch TV, um, which is fine. It's only for a couple days, I believe. Um, but yeah, right now I'm about to, I don't know. Do I want something to drink? I don't know. I don't know. But that's what's going on. I ended up getting some steak from Mariano's earlier. So we had that grilled. Um, I wanted to make asparagus with it, but honestly, <laughs> if the hubby doesn't want any, I'm not going to make any. We just going to have steak and dinner rolls. <laughs> If I'm being honest, I'm not trying to do too much. Like y'all know, I'm doing New Year's dinner. I'm making gumbo tomorrow. So I'm really not trying to go out, you know, or overwork myself when I know I got to wake up early and cook. So yeah. Anyways, just wanted to check in and give you guys an update. I know I shared some clips of me um, in the kitchen cleaning, but wanted to let y'all know where I'm at. I'm just chilling. Okay, right, so I lied. <laughs> I changed my mind. I ended up just doing a light beat on the face, threw on some lashes just so that I can bring in the new year looking halfway decent and set the tone <laughs> for the year because I always, I don't know, I've just been bumming it a lot more than I would like to in 2022. So we, we're switching it up even when we're tired. We're gonna try to put ourselves together and look halfway decent. So um, now, since it's still early, I'm gonna go ahead and make myself a vodka crayon. Um, this is a small one though, um, cause we're just gonna be drinking champagne for the rest of the night. So yeah, I'm gonna make myself a vodka crayon. I Hey guys, happy 2023! Wow, wow, that's nuts. So we made it, it's a whole new year. Wow, there's so much I wanna do this year. There's so much I wanna do and so, so much I need to accomplish this year, but I'm just trying to be grateful because I ain't gonna lie. Y'all know I keep it 100. I was just thinking of all the things that I lack and missing my loved ones who are not here to bring in the new year with me. You know, my dad, thinking about my grandma. Um, but just grateful for the time that I did have with them. And also very excited to see what 2023 brings. Um, so basically I just got cut off because my memory card was full. But what I'm trying to say is, I'm grateful 
for 2022, all the lessons that it brought me, um, all the blessings that it brought me. And I am ready for 2023. 2023 for me is going to be my reaping season. Um, I have sold a lot. I have sold a lot in 2022 and I'm ready to reap. I am ready to get everything I deserved. Um, I often use, um, I use this metaphor for my manifestation. I placed my order. My pizza is supposed to be here this year. Okay. I was very specific in the toppings that I want, the size of the pizza that I want, the type of crust that I want. Um, you know, whether or not I wanted it sliced, I was very specific. Um, and now 2023, I expect my pizza to be delivered to my door. Um, I have my plate ready. I have my napkins ready. I even got a drink. All I need is for God to deliver my blessings because I've worked for it. I deserve it. I'm no longer in a mindset of lack. I'm no longer in a mindset of doubt. I am here to reap everything. And I'm not saying it's going to be easy. It's going to be hot when it come out that box now. You know, it might burn the roof of my mouth a little bit. But I... I'm going to get my blessings and I'm going to eat it and I'm going to enjoy it and I'm going to digest it. Okay. Um, but that's how I'm feeling about 2023 right now. We getting ours this year. Period. That's it. That's it right there. Cut the tape. We getting ours this year. Ain't no other way around it. I don't care what else is happening in the world. That right there, that blessing, that's mine. And it needs to be delivered and dropped off right here. Um, that's how I'm feeling right now. I've done, I've sacrificed so much. Um, I've put up with too much. And now I just, that black girl luxury lifestyle, that black girl abundance, the peace, the joy that comes with letting all that stuff go. That is me in 2023. I'm not taking nothing else. So that's where I'm at. I am about to call it a night though. Um, I ended up, we ended up filling it. We ended up finishing one bottle of champagne um, and then I thought I was done, but instead of opening another bottle and then not finishing the bottle, I decided to just do a little vodka and orange and my champagne flute. Um, so I'm about to finish this and then I'm literally gonna call it a night because as you guys know, I am making dinner for New Year's Day, which is gumbo and I gotta start that so that I could be ready um, to eat by two. Cause I say dinner, but really it's an early world. It's an early dinner, late lunch. So yeah. Anyways, happy new year, y'all. Happy new year. May 2023 bring you all that your heart desires and everything that your life needs. So until the morning, y'all. Good night. Sleep, stay up all night, doing just what I 
how they looking at me. I think they influenced by me. They say they not fucking with me, alright. Wish how they looking at me. She want me to slide for the flame. She want me to show her some things. But right now, I'm focused on me doing me. Gotta watch step on the tightrope. I never fall off this light way. Know it's people trying to see me down real bad. The same ones trying to meet me where I'm at now. Same ones trying to figure how I got here. I be serving my pot, bitch. Shaking my sauce, been writing these sauces. 48 key drops. Tell me when to go. How you think I finna stop? I be protecting my inner child. You could keep all of that distance. They be hating on me because they see I'm gifted. It's all from the soil, your shit 3D printed. I be doing me like I got a blink check. I be decking shade for the love and respect. Wanna touch stage, cross seas on me. No drama, more flights. Next year's looking lit. I'm later. For somebody grass, I'm burning the gas to my last breath. Life is so fragile, enjoying the roses so high you can't see me. I'm seated. She wanna beat me, I'm trying to do Fiji. I live on the island alone. I'm trying to be one with my aura before I allow your soul. Hey guys, happy new year again. I know this is like the first time I'm giving you guys some real FaceTime um, since this morning or since today. Um, but yeah, it's been a hectic day for me. I was cooking all morning, literally all morning. I may have taken like an hour break um, once I got everything situated to just shower and get myself, you know, looking presentable. Um, and then afterwards I added the seafood. I don't even know how much of that was captured um, because I... I think I ran out of memory and I ran out of battery. So, um, yeah. But yeah, so gumbo was fire. I'm sorry, y'all. This puff is just all over the place. So I'm trying to like tuck it and it's not, it's not doing what it's supposed to do. So let me just go ahead and take my hair down. And then we're going to just do a little tuck action. yeah okay so yeah food is done kitchen is semi clean um i just need to wipe down my counters in swiffer or sweep in swiffer um before i go to bed it's not i'm not going to bed right this second but i want to do it when we're done with the kitchen for real because we ate my mother-in-law likes to eat dinner early and so it's really just a late lunch um, so we had gumbo at two and I'm sure we're probably going to get a little hungry, um, before we lay down for the evening or for the night. So, um, I'll finish cleaning up then, but yeah, all in all, the gumbo was good. Everybody was full and fed. We had that cake. We also had some, well, they had sweet potato pie, um, that nothing but cake. If y'all haven't tried it, if y'all have one near you, please give them a try. My favorite flavor is raspberry white chocolate. The cake is just so moist and dense and oh, so good. But um, yeah, so that's really all that I have going on. I'm about to edit um, because I need to edit one and two, I actually need to upload today's video. So you guys are getting a weekly vlog today and then this video is probably going to go up maybe Tuesday or Wednesday. Um, but yeah, so let me get that uploaded and then I will probably check in with you guys when I'm pouring some sorrow. Yeah, I think she want more than a flame. Want me to give her that moonlight. Everything not what it seems. Real one from the jump start. Hey guys, editing Tahita here. Um, I realized that I didn't do a, a proper close out of the vlog and I think I left you guys off um, right when I was just hanging out with my girlfriend or right before I like gave her a call and we were video chatting and catching up. Um, but yeah, so I'm super excited. I need to. But yeah, so I'm super excited to go into this new year. Um, I have so many things that I want to accomplish, so many things that I'm going to do. Um, and I'm just excited for it. New new start. Let's start fresh. Let's start motivated. Let's start determined um, and on a good note. So yeah, that's where I'm at. I thank you guys so, so much 
for watching this video. If you are not yet subscribed, do me that favor and hit that subscribe button. I am trying to get to 4,000 subscribers and I think I'm like at 3,400 and something at this point. So yeah, if you could kindly hit that subscribe button, I would be very much grateful. Um, and yeah, of course, like, share, comment, all that good stuff until the next video. Bye guys.